Praise the Lord. Come on. Let's give God some praise. Lord, praise God. Hallelujah. I know the weather's cold outside. But glory be to God. The spirit on the inside, praise God. Will bring about some heat. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus. Praise God. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. First, give an honor to our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, to our pastor, Reverend Ricky Ezell Sr., to officers, members, and friends, internet guests, good morning. good morning. Praise God. Glory be to God. We will have our hymn down at the cross. We will have prayer by Deacon George Montgomery. Our call responds, and then we will have our praise and worship.
And now Lord God, we we come before you. There's very little that Joy Blue Summer can do, but Lord God, we know one that's still healing the sick, causing flying the sick. So Lord God, right now, we ask that you continue to guide and strength and keep you. Bless us in a mighty way. For your precious name we pray. Thank you, God. Amen. Amen. Amen.
Lord, I feel the Spirit. I feel the Spirit. I feel the Spirit. I feel the Spirit. Well, I feel the Spirit. Tell me what is it doing? Move. Yeah, my soul. Moving in my soul. Oh, and I feel the fire. Well, I feel the fire. I feel the fire. I feel the fire. And I feel the fire. Tell me what is it doing? Oh, yeah, my And I feel, I feel the Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, one of these mornings, it won't be long, look for me, I'll be gone, going up to heaven, to sing and shout, be nobody there, to put me out, Talk to my mother, talk to my father, talk with King Jesus on the other side. I feel Jesus, I feel Jesus, and he's moving, moving in my soul. I feel Jesus. I feel Jesus, and he's moving, moving in my soul. Well, I feel the Spirit, and I feel the Spirit. Oh, I feel the Spirit. And I feel the Spirit. Tell me what is it doing? Move. Yeah. In my soul. Yeah. Moving in my soul. Oh. And I feel. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Moving in my soul. One of these mornings, it won't be long. You'll look for me, I'll be gone. Going up to heaven to sing and shout. Be nobody there to put me out. Talk with my mother, talk with my father. Talk with King Jesus on the other side. I feel Jesus. I feel Jesus. And he's moving, moving in my soul. I feel Jesus. I feel Jesus. And he's moving, moving in my soul. Well, I feel the Spirit. I feel the Spirit. And I feel the Spirit. I feel the Spirit. Oh, I feel the Spirit. And I feel the Spirit. Tell me, what is it doing?
Praise the Lord. I feel the spirit moving in my soul. Praise God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We thank you, Deacon George Montgomery, for the office of prayer. Praise God. Praise God. We thank you, Deacon George, Rich, um, George Montgomery, for the heartfelt prayer. Praise God. And music ministry, we thank you for your praise and worship. Praise God. Do we have anyone visiting us for the very first time? Anyone visiting? Praise God. We thank God for you. Praise God. Yeah. We say to you, we are the church that's full of love, praise God. We love all God's people. And we also say to you, praise God the way you know how to praise him. Because only God knows what he has done for you, and you know what God has done for you. So just praise him, enjoy yourselves, and we say to you, when you come again, bring a friend. Praise God. Thank God for you. You may be seated. It's offering time. Praise God. Come on, let's do a little better than that, praise God. It's offering time. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. He only asked for 10%, praise God. Glory be to God. In Proverbs, the third chapter, around that ninth verse and the 10th verse, he says, honor the Lord. We got to honor God with our first fruits, praise God. With our first increase, no matter what you get, we got to honor God with it, praise God. And in that tenth verse, he said, this is the way our bonds will be filled, praise God. That means he will bless you, praise God. All those who are able to stand, let us stand and bless the offering in advance. Father God, we thank you and give you praise. And we ask you to bless the offering and the tithes, Lord God, and let it be used for the building of your kingdom. Father God, we just ask you to bless, Father God, those desire to give and don't have, and bless those that are giving in the name of Jesus. Father God, we just say thank you because truly you've been good to us. And we thank you for every gift you blessed us with. Thank you, Father God. And Lord, just touch our hearts to be cheerful givers. In the mighty name of Jesus, because none belong to us. It all belongs to you. Thank you, Father God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. To out of ours. 
turn and face the wall, two inner aisles, turn and face each other, follow the direction of the ushers. <clears throat> Yes, I know Jesus, and yes, I know Jesus for myself. Amen. We greet you in the blessed name of God, our Father, Jesus, our Redeemer, the Holy Spirit, our Comforter, and our God. To our presiding officer, Reverend Flossie Montgomery, to Pastor Harper, to each of you, my brothers and sisters, 
on this Christian journey, we greet you in the joy of Jesus through Christ. At this time within our program, we will have our African American reflections at this time, followed by our scripture reading after our African American reflection, our scripture reading by Deaconess Gail Montgomery. Let us receive our African American reflection at this time. Good morning, Central, and welcome to today's African American Reflection. Today's African American Reflection is on the one and only August Wilson. Mr. Wilson was born on April 27, 1945 in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. August Wilson is known for his involvement in the arts during the 1960s a time where African-American artists were given equal opportunities in the theater. In 1968, along with Rob Penny, August Wilson co-founded the Black Horizon Theater in his hometown of Pittsburgh, creating plays that focus on the beauty of black culture. Today, our very own Josh Taylor and his dear friend, Willie Allen, will be performing a scene from one of Mr. Wilson's famous plays, Fences.
proud to be our coming to be this being us and reading our scripture. We want to thank James uh, and designed Mount Pierre Baptist Church and thank Josh, who's at Mount Baptist Central Baptist Church. Josh graduated from Dreher High School. Josh has studied music and drama uh, in New York as well as presently going back to California. Let's give them a hand so much. Better. On our African American Reflects Our Black History program, Cynthia came to me and she said, Reverend Azale, can I be in charge of black history uh, reflection for this month? I said, what you up to? <laughs> and then she brought my wife in with her saying that she was assisting her. So I said, what are uh, y'all up to <laughs> this month? But we've been making announcements about individuals participating. We didn't make the announcement today because all slots are filled. So amen, somebody. Amen, someone. And some of the slots are doubly filled. And what we're doing now, we have young people. We have young adults. We have middle-aged individuals. So we got everybody participating because it's our way history, amen. So thank you so much. Let's give God a hand and couple of praise. Yeah. 
and pain. I made it all right. To persecution. I made it all right. You didn't respect me. I made it all right. so much for you for that selection. Thank you, Deaconess Montgomery, for leading us in the reading of our scripture. We thank God for Deacon George Montgomery for the spirit and the strength of our morning's prayer. We serve an awesome God who could do any and everything but fail. Amen. Let me remind you that not only do we want you to be saved S-A-V-E-D, but we want you to be safe, S-A-F-E, saved and safe. We had just completed, I called them our security consultant with Deacon John Edwards and Deacon Bobby Wright. We just revitalized our total security system here at the church. We just installed 15 high power cameras here at the church. In other words, we can see you when you turn at the red light up there. Amen. Not only do we pick your car, but we zoom in on your license tape. <laughs> Amen, somebody. Amen. We want you to feel safe in worship. Um, even within our vestibule, as I was sitting in my office, in between services, we have cameras that pick up you as you come in the door of the vestibule. And Vernon was behind the little desk moving some paper. I called and said, I see you. <laughs> Amen. And so we try to do everything we possibly can to make sure we have safe worship at our church. Many members don't know location, but we have silent alarm system throughout our church as well. So if anything happens, we have a silent alarm that we can press and it rings directly to law enforcement. And we continue to look for ways to make it safe for worship. We want you saved and safe. Amen. We continue to lift those in prayer.